After Effects is really a great software while creating stunning animations. But when it comes to create subtitles, it takes a lot of time and it's really annoying. You have to deal with multiple text layers to work with subtitles. I've tried multiple scripts to overcome this problem, but I couldn't find a perfect solution and I have to leave After Effects to get my job done, which was frustrating for me. Then I've seen this script called SF Subtitle from Script Fighter and it said, you can create subtitles without leaving After Effects. So then I've given it a shot. And I have to say, it really did the job and saves a lot of time. So let's see how you can also create subtitles in After Effects without leaving the software. So to open the script first, we will go to Windows and scroll towards the bottom until we see our script. And you can see the script called SF Subtitles. So I will click on it and dock it here. You can drag this panel to adjust it according to your preference. Okay, so to create the subtitles, what you have to do is type your texts in this box. Now you might be thinking, should I have to type all the texts by listening the voiceover? And the answer is, of course not. For for example, I have my script ready here on my notepad, and all I have to do is copy this text and paste inside this box. And here, you can see your subtitles are ready to be generated. It's that so simple. Now the one thing which you have to keep in mind is, you have to add breaks in this caption, otherwise it will display a lot of text at a time. So what you have to do is go at the text where you feel it should start on the next line, and then hit enter and do this for each part of the subtitles where you feel a pause is needed. Don't worry if we forget something, then we can edit the subtitles later. Now we will choose our font by going into the Characters panel. I'm using Montserrat Bold font here. Now when this is done, let's see how we can create backgrounds behind our text layers. So, to create background, we will click on this setting buttons, and you will see a new interface, so let's understand it one by one. So here you can select your text background. The first one resembles no background. The second will add background only behind your text layer. And the third one will create a rectangular box, something like this. So choose this according to your need. You can select your background color by clicking on this color and select your color which you want to use. You can also adjust the transparency of the background by this opacity value. I'm going to use the middle one for this tutorial. So I will choose this and exit from here and press Create Subtitles. And within some seconds, your subtitles are ready. Now when you generated the subtitles, then you can see Subtitles Background Layer is created with our subtitles. And if you press the background layer and go to Effects and Control, then you can see the two sliders. The first one is used to adjust the background size. It can be really helpful if you have changed your font to bigger font. The second slider can be used to add rounded corners on your background, which looks really cool. Now let's see how you can work with your subtitles. So I will select the SF Subtitles layer and press U to reveal the keyframes. Now if you drag these keyframes, then you can notice our subtitles are changing, so I will use these keyframes to arrange the subtitles according to my voiceover. It's really easy to manage subtitles this way because we don't have to mess with multiple layers. You can take full control of your subtitles on a single layer. By following these simple steps, you can now create subtitles in After Effects. Now let's take a look how you can edit the subtitles after creating it. So let's suppose there's a spelling mistake in this part of the video and I want to fix it. I will move my playhead to that specific keyframe and press edit button, and here we are able to see the text. So I will review all the mistakes, and when it's done, I will simply press apply. And you can see our subtitles are fixed. If you want to edit the whole subtitles, then click on this source text button, and this will select all the keyframes and click edit, and now you will be able to edit your subtitles easily. You can also do this by clicking this edit button while pressing control key, and make sure you have selected the SF subtitles layer. If you want to change your font, then what you have to do is reveal all the keyframes and select all of them, and make sure you are on any one of them. And now you can change your fonts by going into the Characters panel. And you can also tweak every property in Characters panel according to your preference. See this? I can change the size of the text by this slider, and I can even adjust the spacing between lines. Basically, you can take full control of your text without compromising anything. You can create trending subtitles like Ali Abdal in no time and charge premium rate from your clients. If you want to use all caps in your subtitles, then use this checkbox while editing your subtitles and hit apply. Then just like that, your job is done. This script also generates subtitles in right to left language. For example, I want to create subtitles for this language and add breaks in my subtitles, so I will hit this button and then generate my subtitles. This little extra features could be a really time saver while working with subtitles.
This script also offer you to import or export your subtitles. All you have to do is select SF Subtitles layer, then press this export button and choose your desired location. You can export your text in various formats depending on your need. It can be a very useful feature for sharing your script to other people, so you can do it too without using any third-party tools. And this is the best script I've used so far for working with subtitles in After Effects, so please check the script from the link in the description. It's a must-have tool which every editor should have. I hope you liked the video, and if you don't want to miss these insane tutorials, then please hit the bell icon to get notified. Thanks for watching.